Hi, my name is Aoife Murray and I work here in the aviation section of the forecasting division in MetAaron. And I've been in MetAaron about 12 years now. I firstly joined um, as an observer and I was in Mallon Head for almost two years. I then came back to Dublin and I was working on the climate database and this houses our national climate archive. And for the last four years I've been working as an aviation forecaster here in Glasnevin HQ. So I was going to talk to you a bit about what we do here. We are responsible for issuing meteorological information for the Shannon Flight Information Region or FIR and it's on the screen here behind me, hope you can see it, and it goes out here um, to 15 west in the Atlantic. So what information do we issue? The main product we issue is the Terminal Aerodrome Forecast or TAF and I have a set of them here in front of me and I'm monitoring them against the live reports that are coming in from the airports. These forecasts are for the main parameters that are of interest to the aviation community, namely wind, visibility, weather and cloud-based height. So we issue them, we also issue warnings. So the warnings are of a local scale, so these are for the airports and these could be for snow, winds, very strong winds and things like thunderstorms at an airport. We also issue warnings for the wider flight information region and these would be for larger scale phenomena such as embedded thunderstorms, areas of severe icing and volcanic ash. And an example of one here behind me, we can see an area of red here over the London flight information region and it corresponds to this active frontal system we can see here on the radar. So that's an example of a SIGMET. Other products we issue are significant weather charts for below 10,000 feet and I have an example here behind me and we also issue search and rescue forecasts and we have regular telephone briefings with the wider aviation community such as private pilots, gliders and balloonists. And just to let you know I'm the treasurer of the Met Society so if you are interested in joining you should look at irishmeteorologicalsociety.ie and I'm also the director here at Medairn of our choir and we're called the Isobars, so listen out for us in the future.